This weekend, I crewed a backyard ultra marathon for my roommate because I don't know, he must hate himself. I, why else would anyone willingly subject himself to something like this? But it was fun for me and I enjoyed recording it. So if you enjoy content like this, let me know and I'll make more of it. But subscribe if you haven't and goodbye. All right, dude. It's fucking time. Yeah. You excited? Yeah, I'm so excited. Super nervous, but more excited than nervous. It should be fun. I think this is going to be so awesome. But I don't think we describe what we're doing today. So it's called a Backyard Ultra Marathon. We are running a 4.2 mile loop every hour on the hour until there's only one person left. Hopefully I'm that one person left. We're gonna see what happens. Weather's looking fun. Probably a little rain. We're up at 9,000 feet, so you never know what the, for if what the forecast says is gonna be right, but we're gonna get her done. <laughs> All right, dude, well, we got one hour to the race. Yep. I'm excited. Yeah, I know you let's are. Let's do it. Let's fucking do this, dude. Let's do it. Let's Sign fucking do it. Out. <laughs> we got the rest of camp ready, which consisted of a tent for Aaron to sleep in and lie down and keep some things dry, a pong table, and two boxes of utilities consisting of things he might need during the run, one of which was just packed with food. And by food, I mean all candy, because apparently that's what you eat during a backyard ultra marathon. But before we knew it, it was time for the race to get started. All right, let's go. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Ugh. All right. This take is kind of three? take. Yeah, this is like take three. I keep messing two it up. And a half? Two and a, yeah, kind of like two and a half. The last one yeah. didn't really count. I had no clue what a backyard ultra was until Aaron. Yeah, until Aaron brought Who this up to me. Who is our runner? Yeah, Aaron's our runner. Aaron's my roommate. This is Gabby also, on crew. We're both on crew mm -hmm. for Aaron. Uh, we're we're just taking care of him basically. This is kind of the objective for the weekend. Yeah, he make is, sure he eats. Get him clothes if he needs it. Yeah, probably Anything wipe him. Else, have like a <laughs> give him a wipe. Help him medical eat. Medical bin. bin. Um, yeah. Quesadillas, ramen. Yeah, I'll be helping him. Pee. Yeah. And the reason the course is 4.2 miles, I know that sounds really specific, is that once you hit, is it 24? 24 I think, 20, I think for like loops? one day, yeah. Yeah, you hit 100 miles. And so basically, people are definitely aiming for that because they get a belt buckle. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And the only other prize is first place gets $1,000, right? Yeah. This will be good. We got a lot of time to kill. Thought I kind of just document some of this because it's like. Yeah, because uh, for the first bit for crewing, we're just kind of putting nerd clusters in a bowl. And yeah. making his water concoction. Yesterday I was banging my head out in my lab, just couldn't get my experiment to work. And now today I'm sitting in the mountains as my roommate is gonna tire himself to just near death experience. Yeah, exactly. it's gonna be great. Near yeah. Can't wait to do it. Alright. Check it out. Stay soon. tuned. All right, well, this is kind of like our job for like every hour, right? Just prepping food. And so for breakfast, we have 16 nerd clusters. Breakfast, is this breakfast? I mean, we're kind of getting close uh, to lunch. It's like, yeah, true. I mean, it's going to be like, it's going to be like eight lunches and like 10 dinners. So Aaron has a list where essentially he has laid out exactly what food he needs to eat every hour. And our job is to make sure that when he gets back, it's all ready to go for him. So all he has to worry about is just eating it and get ready for the next lap. Right now, it's obviously pretty easy for him. Once we get into the night hours, this is gonna be pretty important, so. Meal number one, Nerds Gummy Clusters Ritz Crackers. Gold. <laughs> Honey Stinger, gold. It's, I find it very interesting, the things that it's like good to eat. Like he yeah. he's gonna be consuming. Well, it's like 400 selling calories an hour, right? Uh, yeah, I think he said like 465, like something oh, super specific. Okay, Oliver, that's someone's tent. <laughs> so he's got this dialed. Oh. Got to make sure to look at it. Eye level, account for the parallax air. Freshman year physics lab is in chemistry labs coming in clutch now. So you never let them tell you that those labs are useless because look at us now. Yeah, look at us now. I'm measuring out. Look at that. That's see, I'm off because I didn't look down at it, but almost 16 ounces. Yeah, but yeah. All right. We're also learning. Yeah, we're we're kind of we're figuring it out as we go. Other people here are like more experienced and they know what they're doing. We have no clue what we're doing, so we're kind of just figuring it out. But we have a base base yeah. camp. We don't need to technically be anywhere except for. Other people got like official stuff. Our base camp is a pong table. Yeah, people have noticed. Yeah, <laughs> people have taken attention to the pong table already. So we might might need to run some pong in a bit. Feeling good. <laughs>
feeling great. Gonna eat some snacks and chill out for a second. We have so much time right now. Five, four, three, two, one. Man, I have so much homework. But look at that. I, I think I have an objective to meet every dog here by the end. Yeah, the goal for us is to become friends with all the dogs. Yeah. What are their names? Um, this one's Sherman and this one's Winston. Hi, Winston. Sherman likes pets under the chin and Winston just likes pets. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, I would take one of we're, we're stealing. We're stealing. Yeah. So our goal in this next 24 hours is to have all the dogs. We're gonna steal every dog. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Still felt super easy on this one? Yeah. Elevation isn't doing too much right now? I mean, I notice it, right? But it doesn't feel bad, right? Yeah. Like my heart rate's higher than it would be if I was doing this base, but that makes sense. Um, but yeah, everything's fine right now. Right, cool. We've been meeting all the dogs. That's awesome. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know if I could do one of these. Yeah, you could. Come on. You think I do one, maybe two? It's a beach day. <laughs> it's really nice. <laughs> the lovely weather. Oh, um, like, just put like three Ritz in there for now. I'll still get a couple in. Okay. I'm trying to edge the Oreos. <laughs> um, try, I want to give myself something to look forward to, but I'm not feeling that bad yet. So. Sandwich time. Thrilled with our sandwiches. I got a chicken salad sandwich with bacon. What's yours? Classic turkey, tomato, onion, lettuce. Did I say mayo? Mayo. We are definitely going to be here a long time. Yeah, we've been talking to some people. The one woman we were talking to, her husband's already done two 100 mile races, so we're trying to gauge when people are gonna drop out. We're kind of just vibing our way through it right now. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna sit in the car for as long as we can. <laughs> Bye! Dude, I, I think, I'm pretty sure I walked like 80% of that lap. Good. That was a very restful lap. <laughs> the only hard part about this course is the first my 1.2 miles. Easy after that. Where are we going? Uh, we're gonna do a quick hike. Quick hike. Up. up we're there. bored. Our our day is so five. hard. Hour five. Our yeah, hour five. We were here two hours before. Oh yeah, we were here for like seven and a half because we got here. Yeah. We got here around eight actually, so like seven. Seven, hours. seven. but seven. then like the drive. We're like six. Saw six, moose seven. on the drive. Like six, seven, maybe? I'm talking into the phone as if like it can hear me, but I forget it's this mic. Yeah, no, it's yeah, it's right here. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah technology. Yeah. It's like crazy. six, seven, probably. Like. Uh, Aaron looks great. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> but like, I mean, he yeah, he might like be running 4.2 miles every hour, and he's on like hour five of doing that. But let's really talk about who's got it real difficult out here. It's us. We're so <laughs> bored. We have food, snacks, a warm car. A lot of goldfish. A lot of goldfish. But it's been going well. Learning a lot about ourselves. Apparently I have ADHD. Learn that Gabby has ADHD <laughs> because I have ADHD and immediately figured out that your symptoms are the same. Like, yeah. It's pretty great. And Italian. And Italian. I'm 50 And we have mutual friends. And mutual friends. That's crazy. It's been a good day. A lot of yapping. A lot, lot of yapping. more yapping to go. It's We're only going to need to yap more to fight through the tiredness. Yeah, honestly, nothing has truly started until the evening into the night. Yeah. As Aaron said, race hasn't even started yet. How so. small do you think we look? Uh, Probably not that small. Uh, let's go <laughs> find out. All right, that's all. Bye. I feel like we're pretty far away. Three, two, one... We found a road.
Jacob's course. And we're occupying our brains now. Yeah. What could go wrong? <laughs> Nothing could go wrong. There's definitely not signs that say, please stay off. I can't read. Um. Anyway, this is definitely a en enrichment. This, we need this for our energy. We needed to up the vibes with two, this. 2 a.m. <laughs> 2 a.m. We're going to be on the ropes course. Probably. We're going to be like, we really need something to do. Let's go to the ropes course. You need to get the zoomies out. Feet still feel fine, but I feel just the slightest bit of rubbing. So i got to be smart about it. But yeah, that lap felt fucking phenomenal. Okay, good. Yeah, I, I think that's how the race is going to be. I yeah, yeah, yeah. Like you have the bad well, one and then you have the good one. It was just that, that tummy ache really killed that that's one lap. Happened. Yep, it'll happen again There's and again like and again, and I'm gonna get on that start line again and again and again. We keep finding new rooms. We got a basketball court now. I can't play basketball for the life of me. I'm gonna go to the sport I'm better at. today over under four and a half games until the buffalo sabers actually score a fucking goal they're so ass bro oh my god also bill's hype song yeah mr brightside Woo. Like Bill, night rolling around how we doing Me the mental the mental is going first like i again like doubt creeps in but like the body is fine right now five four three two one good luck <laughs> Gabby, what have you done? Um, I may have tried to collapse the chair while the chocolate milk was still there. This is why you take your time with things. You gotta clean this. <laughs> Night's rolling in too. Hour nine of the race. Hour We've nine. been here for Look at that. Hours. Look at that. Oh my god. Let's just get started. Don't cry over spilled milk, kids. <laughs> <laughs> And a bitch he was not, because even though this may have been the lap where the battle between his altitude and his stomach was decided, running almost 60 miles in 14 hours is no bitch thing to do. But everyone should comment like, good job Aaron, Aaron you're so cool, and also then go check out his new YouTube channel which I'll put in the bio of this video, because I support him and you should too. But if you want to see more in-person content on my end of what goes on behind the scenes of the PhD life and see that, you know, people actually do have a life that's not just doing research all the time, then let me know and I'll make more of these things. But besides that, then subscribe if you, I don't know, don't hate puppies. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.